Tiša. Honorable Chairperson, the department uh, proposed that it is there to drive industrialization, create jobs, develop skills through our state-owned companies. Saying it is very different to doing it. If anything, we are seeing deindustrialization, shedding jobs, and a continuing deficit in scarce uh, skills. Under the circumstances, we must conclude that the department is failing. Clearly, the department is not delivering on its mandate. The department claims that state-owned companies have emerged as key instruments for creating jobs. Minister, will you please back up this big claim with big figures? We want to interrogate the statistics. As state-owned companies are the very cornerstone of the economy, it is natural to use them in a strategic manner to support the delivery of the national development plans uh, outcomes. The NDP has numerous targets, and we ask the minister to enlighten us on the achievement of state-owned companies in achieving them. Let me now come to the very important function of state-owned companies supporting socio-economic transformation. This is the imperative of our times. In every township in our country, people have waited for 21 long years to witness socio-economic transformation. Did socio-economic transformation take place in Soweto, in Umlazi, in Dimbaza, in Kayelicha? Did any other township realize at this goal? In rural areas, the same thing has been the case. We have to ask questions because the department is extremely thin on furnishing proof and facts. The department's transfer of oversight of South African Airways to National Treasury is a good development. Likewise, it is good that the department has transferred broadband in Franco to the Department of Telecom. It must empty its portfolio so that we have a fewer ministers, and I want to emphasize that. The department is also wasting uh, resources in hiring consultants to conduct technical research. The reduction of 23.6 million rand by cabinet is not enough. This department is achieving literally nothing and creating unnecessary overlaps. Having state managers in the department over other state appointed other managers in the state-owned companies creates wheels within wheels. There is only one solution. The president of South Africa, wherever he is, and if he is listening, and he has not gone to marriage, for example, we say to you, President, you must close this department. COPE is very dissatisfied with the performance of this department. It has not met the targets it set itself. All we have had is very heavy load shedding. This is happening in wrong places. Please come in our forward. people, load shedding must happen in government, not among the ordinary people. As I step down, my chairperson, I want to say to you, in very big countries such as China, where you have about 1.3 billion people, you have 18 ministers, and here we're talking about 78, and loss and loss of monies. Thank where you. are our people? Thank you. Thank you.